All right, let's go talk to the fucking brother. Do a fucking sick K turn. Go straight there. It's like my go-to in this fucking game now that I have the sprint. Uh, it's my go-to in every game when I have a sprint. Actually, was this its own thing that I could go up to? What is this? Can I dock here? No. No, I can't. Okay. That's like a f like full-blown shipyard. That's some industrial-style shit. Alright. I guess I'll just never know. Um, hey, you whale man. Mm. What is it? I believe this crest is yours. Gods, I haven't seen this since... So we did take it. I knew it. Your brother's sorry. Will you let him come home? Mm, I don't know if I was in the right state when he left. Fine, he can stay in my old workshop, at least for the time being. I'll, have, I'll need some time to clear it out. It's that big place over there. I own the largest shipyard on this side of Ingfil. Well, I mean, this side of Ingfil is really just this side of Ingfil, so... It's still impressive. That's a, that's a nice building. Very big. Like, warship style big. What the fuck are you building there? I'm doing that. Perhaps you can do something for me. See, I've been trying to clear some debris and pathways through the cliffs to make a shortcut with explosives. I was able to set a charge, but the cliff seemed particularly unsteady that day, so I didn't risk detonating it. You just need to get in there and set it off. It's not far in. There's some yellow flags nearby. You can't miss it. Anything else? Uh, where were these explosives? Mm. Head through the rock arch in the southeast. Follow the channel. You see the yellow flags on the right. Anything else? What, but where are the explosives? I guess they're just there? Oh, he said he left. Okay, I guess he left the explosives there. Irresponsible, really. Okay. Well, I have to worry about the fucking monster, too, though. <laughs> it's literally in, like, a very narrow corridor. I don't know if I want to fuck with a giant monster in a very narrow corridor. Alright, let's give it a shot. Uh, is that a fucking... I haven't fucked with this. Is it okay to drive past this? Like... Okay, they don't move. I guess if I just hit it, it would be pretty bad. <laughs> I'm not gonna touch that. <laughs> Alright. Where's this f fucking giant monster? Oh, oh, things are getting red. That's okay, it's just, that's just rock. There it is! There's the motherfucker. Can't get me here, can you? Oh, that's terrifying. Oh, I hate that. This is the final evolution of a fucking e uh, eel. I knew it would be like this. Hold on, I want to dredge this to go on here. I really hope it can't fit back here. I feel like this is here to be a safe place. Uh, what is it? Oh, bag of doubloons. Hey, that's literal money. You think I'd just be able to open that straight up? Uh, I hear the bubbly noise. It makes me think that thing is still nearby. Oh, is that just how these caves sound? I hate that. Oh, I hate this so much. The thalassophobia is real. Jesus Christ. Okay, what do I need to do here? Just interact, please, right? Pile of loose debris in the uh, in the gaps between the rocks. You see what um, appears to be large white teeth. It's coming for me, isn't it? I... Wh 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 There's a long fuse trailing out from the side. This must be the location the whaler once cleared for a shortcut. Light the fuse? Fuck yeah. Maybe I can get that giant fish... I thought I'd have to run away or something. Okay, this is okay. Yeah, kind of thought the fish, or I would like it if I could kill the fish with that. The debris crumbles away. You should let the whaler know. Yeah, poke. the giant fucking fish was scared off by the loud explosive. I hope it's like, ooh, what was that noise? Ooh, I'm going to hide in my deep subterranean cave for a while. Oh. I mean, fish do hate. Oh, I say fish. But literally, anything underwater hates a loud noise, like an explosion. Ugh, I hate that. Because it, uh, the, the fucking... Oh, uh, it feels like it's here. Oh, every shape in the water looks like it. <laughs> I'm literally, literally the person that would be the worst uh, case um, boatman for this. There it is. Oh, oh, it's actually swimming out here. Is it doing laps? Where's it going? It's terrifying how close that thing gets to y'all's, like, civilization. Okay, so it just does laps around that way. Okay, fuck this. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Alright. I was pro I was saying something before all that, and now I'm just terrified. Uh, Whaler. 
You've done it, I heard that blast from here, I'm going to the echo. I'm surprised the cliffs didn't come down on your head. I've got things ready here, go and tell my brother, that he can come home. Um, <laughs> but there's still a giant fish over there. I do love, though, that this is the type of game where I don't think, it, for the most part... Oh, it's a spout, okay. It, it, this is the type of game, for the most part, where I don't think I actually will fight the monster, which makes the monsters way more appealing. I, I love it in a game where it's like, the the threat is just, like, unstoppable. It's like Alien Isolation, terrifying game. You can't do shit, well you can do, you can like dissuade uh, the Xenomorph, but you can't kill it. It's not like um, the other Alien game that I played with like Roy, Colonial Marines. Colonial Marines is a fucking joke, but in like a fun way. Hello again, what can I do for you? Your brother forgives you. He's found you a place to stay. He does? That's a huge weight off my chest. One so old I hardly remembered it was there. Right, well I'm packed and ready to go. Alright. Make some space in your boat. You're gonna carry me. God damn it, I thought you could take care of yourself, you fucking old man. Oh, I really I really do. I mean, fair, it's what I was expecting, but there you go. The hermit climbs aboard with all of his belongings. All two of them. Alright, Hermit. I hope we don't get attacked by a giant fucking eel in the meanwhile. Eww, it's getting kind of dark. Oh, fuck. Oh, this way, this way. Eww. It gets so fucking dark in this game that it's really hard to see, like, anything. It's from Fog 2 in particular. I really, like, this game is un... not unintentionally. It's surprisingly horrific. <laughs> I love it. Well, here we are. The hermit notices the old whaler standing on the dock, waiting for him. Oh, you fucking piece of shit. I can't believe you came back. Crawling back to me, you son of a bitch. I fucking hate you, brother. I can't believe I spent all this time thinking about how I was guilty of everything I did to you. Now I want to go over there and punch you in the face. I'll fucking kill you. Come over here. And then they just kiss. The two brothers walk away down the dock. One of them pauses for a moment, turns back to you. Wh which one? Oh, okay, that one. <laughs> Stranger, if you find any more debris that needs clearing, I'm working on making more packed explosives. Oh. Come on, the old whaling yards any time. Cool. I'm down for that. Actually, oh, I do need some. Hold on, can I go tonight? Oh, here, this is all the house. Why don't you help? Oh, he made the explosives out of, like, teeth? Dude, that's fucking metal. I love that. I love that for you. Hope you can put them to good use wherever you find calls for it. Oh, damn, he sells a lot of them. Well, I really only need the one. Because <laughs> I don't care about side shit. Yeah, I just need to blow up the thing that's uh, blocking my my good dredge. I need to get that good shit out of there. Alright. Full power. Full steam ahead. Maybe it's early enough in the morning that the eel won't be awake. He's got a busy fucking uh, night. So he, he spends most of the day sleeping. That's what I would love to imagine. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm sure this thing just fucking wakes up whenever the hell it wants. Alright, uh, so how do I actually use- okay, just interact. Perfect. I'm glad I don't have to escape it, either. That was- that was intense. Okay, use explosives. Set the charge and light the fuse. Easy game. Alright, let's get some dredge. Easy. Uh, oh, I don't know why, it's like I want to challenge myself by making it go down in between- like, I don't even have to. Oh, sapphire earrings? Is that what I wanted? Oh, stock has been depleted. I mean, is this where the red light was? Wait, I can still dredge. What is that? Oh, the music box. Okay, I do need that. Okay, no no fancy maneuvers. We're just going to take full advantage of all the wide open spaces. And there we go. Complete. Not, oh, god damn, this thing's big. Good thing I have the space. I needed to sell some of this shit. Get some upgrades done. I love that the upgrades just... Like, you can just give the materials to them and they'll hold on to it for you. It's like, I have enough inventory management issues to worry about. Uh, so let's head back to... What is it? Oh, it's like stormy. Oh, it's like actually raining. Oh, shit. Okay, we'll go back to, what, Blackstone Isle? Drop off the music box. Probably figure out where to go to next after that. See if I can get some of this extra shit out of my inventory. I need to go to the trinket guy especially, because I have a lot of unnecessary... Shit. That was very bubbly. What was that? Uh, oh, oh, okay. Those are just dolphins. Okay. Uh, their noises aren't. Set. <laughs> it's still scary to me. 
I'm half expecting at some point, um, it, it just like normal over the seas travel isn't going to be safe. Also, I'm expecting those dolphins to just get fucking ripped underwater. <laughs> Just like I see them, something drag them to the briny depths. I'm just like, uh, <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> oh, those are fucking goddamn. Those orcas are giant. Oh my god, those dolphins I was swimming by are fucked. Those are, ugh. Fuck off! Fuck off! I hate you. I hate the ocean. Should I even be? Oh god. Should I even be like over this deep water? This really triggers my. <laughs> My thalassophobia, fuck. I don't even, I have like mild thalassophobia, I feel. Cause I've, there's like, I, I've seen people like not be able to play this game just cause it's like, you look straight down, you can't see anything. It's like, what the? It makes me uneasy. It makes, it gives me an actual like, it gives me actual sickness, bro. Now I feel like distinctly uncomfortable looking down into the deep water, but it doesn't like, I don't get paralysis or anything from it. Still, though. As soon as something actually comes out of the water, though, I freak the fuck out. Alright, super trustworthy guy. So you've returned. I wasn't sure you were coming back. You drag the massive music box into the room, gouging the wooden floors beneath it. The collector doesn't seem to mind. He's focused on the box. So you mind explaining why you're after this uh, comedically large music box? You found this at the cliffs, didn't you? I don't remember. <laughs> Um, sure. I don't know how, how much my options matter in this game. Ah, excellent. This should make a future, uh, make future return journeys a little more swift. Allow me. Yo, fast travel. He uh, selects one of the silver ribbons trailing from the crimson bound book, opening it to some unseen page. Turning to catch the dim light, he whispers the words on the page. Photogon, the classic. After a few seconds, you feel your sudden your stomach drop suddenly. You feel your sudden drop stomachly. You feel your stomach drop suddenly as though thrown high by a wave. He closes the book and turns his attention back to you. So each time I do this, he gives me a cool magic power. I didn't know that. That's sick. Hmm. Manifest. Instantly return to Blackstone Isle. That's so convenient. Now there are yet more relics to find. Keep looking. The reef at Stellar Basin may have caught and accumulated some wreckage. Search around that area. All right. Sounds good. Mm -mm. I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? Uh, what are you doing with these? Collecting them, of course. An investment for times to come. Anything else? I, I'm glad he keeps it, like, short and simple. Why can't you search for these yourself? The ocean no longer wishes to cooperate. As the waves are unsafe for me, you will be my surrogate. I don't... I don't like hearing surrogate used like that. Anything else? What are those words you're reading? The book holds power from the deep. I merely extended its power towards you. Is one particularly you wish to know about? I, I mean, lore-wise or like ability? I don't know. Use of these words will induce a trance-like state. While in this state, time will pass in the blink of an eye. When it is over, you'll find yourself here. Wow. So you're just like turning the, your brain off for fast travel. I like that. That's convenient. Sometimes, actually, I feel like sometimes I, I do have that ability. You know, when the drive's just, like, routine enough, you kind of just zone out, and then you get to your destination, like, shit, what happened on that drive? I don't even know. As always, I caution against overusing this. Selectively and strategically utilize it when you need it most. Um, tell me about haze. Well, I'm in a lore mood now, damn. The words of haste are instant and cruel. They'll impart a terrible speed to your vessel. Be warned, however, it may put a great deal of stress on your engines. Uh, well, I don't have any other power, so cool, man. Thanks. Um, why is this? I don't know. Uh, I don't. Oh, take a look at these trinkets. Oh, I can sell them to him. Oh no, no. <laughs> He's like, get that garbage away from me. Oh, uh, is it's only what eight? Eight's not too bad. Let me go. Drop off some of this shit back at Little Marrow. Oh, oh, careful. There's the lighthouse. I whoa. Oh, my crabs. Needs repair, man. Okay, we'll just. Okay, good. I did get it. I was worried at first. Wait. No, that's not Little Marrow. That's the. I don't even. Oh, it's that. It's that fucking fake boat again. Fuck off. I know your trick. God damn. Fast and furious over here. Oh, wait. 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 Wait, 
Oh, 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 oh. Fuck off. You can't get this close to town. That's not cool. It's not fair. How am I avoiding these things? Holy shit. Alright. Got away. Just in time. Oh, holy hell. I hate... I hate the ocean. <laughs> I'm glad I was able to escape like that. Oh, jeez. The lighthouse keeper is waiting for you on the dock, looking displeased. I saw you sailing out towards the horizon, crossing that deep expanse. You really think that's wise? No, I hate it. I hate it so much. But what's the problem? It feels a bit like tempting fate, does it not? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it really does. Things are bad enough around here without your provocations. Abruptly, she walks away. You're not gonna, you're not gonna explain like more about why it's bad. I, I would love to know that actually. Her eyes scan the water. She walks along the dock. You old bitch. <laughs> All right, let's go to the ship right and drop some shit off. How do I actually do? Uh, fuck, I don't remember. Where's the actual like upgrade thing? Oh wait, no, I need to go to the actual shipyard. That's I might as well wait. Repair? Why do I need repair? I'm fine. What am I repairing? Everything's great. I don't need to repair shit. Fuck you. <laughs> I ain't doing none of that. Okay, dry dock. What will take a large heap of scrap? Modify two cargo spaces to also hold rods? I mean, that's not bad, but what else do I have? Hold engines. I kind of just want, like, more space. That's... Hmm, I don't have any... Wait, new hull. Oh. I guess I need to... Do I have to upgrade more? Yeah, I have to upgrade, like, one other thing, I guess. Um, engines? No, let's get a new rod. Why not? Put that there. I need cloth and two lumber. And I need to sell all this other garbage. Ugh, it's feeling much more cramped than in the early days. Let's see. Where is the... Oh, uh, the trinket guy is not even here, is he? Man, I have to go back and forth so much. Um, here, have a crab. It's so sad. Five dollar crab. Lousy weather lately. It almost makes you not want to get out of bed. When you know you gotta do it, huh? Where would pe keeps people from going hungry? I don't know if you do that. I feel like what is it? there's like a fly. It just went into the fish. You're killing people, man. This is unhealthy. Um, it's only it's only eleven. I could probably make it to the guy that buys trinkets, even though the. F the big fucking anglerfish was right on my ass. No, I could probably do it. <laughs> oh, that's not a great idea. Hold on, what's my... Actually, I could just put some shit away. Actually, I kind of want to put the crab thing away, because it's like, it's not really making or breaking my career as a fisherman. It's kind of just taking space. I'll just put that away. I'll worry about it when I need to catch crabs. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna go across, see if that guy will buy my shit. It's a little late. Time passes, like, way faster than I ever anticipate to, but I'm give it a shot. I mean, surely at this point, like, the angler went off to go fuck with somebody else. God, every bit of noise I hear, though, just makes me think something's out here after me. But we good? Yeah, see, okay, that didn't actually take as long as I, as I thought it would. Oh, I hear that fake boat. Haha, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> Go fuck with somebody else. Here, trader. Oh, $102. Fuck yeah. That's enough for all the times I crash into m shit. I'm gonna need that. Uh, and I don't care about the painter. We rest. We rest, we recuperate, and we go to the next zone. Although, is that. Hmm. Oh, wait, actually. Uh, I could go to that island where that lady, uh, the constructin, constructin, construction lady made her home. I don't know, that's like too optional for me. <laughs> I don't worry about that. Oh my god, there's so much more space than I realized. Okay, so now I need to go southwest. Across the big, wide open ocean like the lady cautioned me about. Yeah, not the best idea. Also, that's a... Oh, I know what this is. An atoll, that's what that is. Yeah, I only know that from... Wait, is it an atoll? I about to say, I only know that from, like, the Gamera movie. But, uh... I'm pretty sure they were calling him an atoll because he is, like... An island. <laughs> he looked like an actual island. The thing I'm thinking of is, like, you know, it's a volcano's partially forming. 
So like in the ocean, there's like a ring in the water. So I don't know if that's actually an atoll, but then again, I don't know. I'm also remembering a really bad uh, Destroy All Humans game for the Wii that I think um, also is called an atoll. I don't know, I literally have the ability to look it up. Hold on. Let's just look up atoll. What does an atoll? Oh, you know, it's an atoll. Okay, yeah. I guess in in Gamera, they're like freaking out that it's an atoll because they like ran into it. Finally made it home. Dredge hype! Dude, you missed the fucking hypest part. I was going through these, uh, like, cliff valleys, and a giant fucking eel came out of nowhere and spooked the hell out of me. It was really bad. I had a bad time. But I got cool new boat powers, so something came out of it at the very least. Mario 64 style. You know, kind of. He did give me Mario 64 eel vibes. Although the only- when I think Mario and eels, I think of the one from Super Mario Sunshine and you gotta brush its teeth. That one's much more friendly, way less horrifying. Uh, why is it suddenly like the goddamn desert over here? I've not gone that far. You know, I keep forgetting that I think this game has like the... what's the word I'm thinking of? I guess like the scale is much more different than I think it is. Or it's like bigger than I think it is. So, yeah, that probably makes sense. I'm- oh, is that a crash boat? Yeah, it's a crash boat. I won't worry about dredging that. I still got my other shit to worry about. Uh, is that a radio dish? What is that doing out here? In what I presume is the 50s of the 1800s. Uh, there's a lot of noises out here, but... Actually, I haven't caught any fish out here either. I'm kind of curious. What strange creatures lurk in the depths out here? Yeah, maybe I- you know, I do need wood and some cloth, so... Fuck, but I also need, like, a place to stay for the night. Um... Let's just risk it, go further in. Ooh, it is... it is deep in this atoll. <laughs> fucking hate that. <laughs> hate that so- oh, I hate the fucking canyon. What is that? Ooh, there's, like, pretty lights out there. You know, pretty lights in this game has proven to be bad. Oh, jellyfish! Oh, that's cool. Uh, is this like a place I can actually rest at? Oh, I can dredge here. Let's do it. Why do I... Is that jellyfish, like, coming for me? No, okay, he passed by. Okay, it's broken spectacles. Sick! Some cool aviators. But can I park my boat here and sleep? Okay, I can. That's good to know. That's good to know. Um... There's, like, something moving. It's probably just seaweed. Luminescent seaweed. I'm not gonna worry about it. It's easier to just not think about things. Uh, weird. Kind of thought I'd be able to see the red light in the sky marking my next objective, but I guess not. Luminescent eel. <laughs> no. I've seen enough eels in this game. They're bad news. Glacio was, like, very aggressive. He showed up and he fucking went for me. Oh, hey, research bar. That's good to have. Uh, I don't want to f go into unfamiliar territory when it's getting late. I'm just gonna hunker down. I'm gonna bed up at this abandoned fucking research facility. That really is, like, a satellite dish. I don't know what year I'm supposed to be in. <laughs> I'm very confused about that now. Oh, let's put this in. Hell yeah, now I can fish in volcanic waters. Love it. Uh, let's see. Generate. Oh, yeah, there's lab generator. So this has got to be, like, I guess 1920s. You might be in remote waters. Maybe. We're just some civilization very far removed from, like, the rest of society. So it's, like, technology is kind of a little backwards, but we still have things like radio dishes. We got to be in, like... Maine. <laughs> Maine is the most far removed place I know about. The laboratory is in ruins with equipment and research papers strewn about the place. Where do you want to look? Oh, hell yeah. Wait, there's no floorboards I can check? Fuck. Now, I'm not gonna lie, this game gives me such... Like, it, it gives me so many good ideas for, like, D&D, &D, uh, like, adventures. Honestly, it's just Ghost of Saltmarsh. <laughs> just, I just want to play Ghost of Saltmarsh with, uh modern day <laughs> modern day era and just call it dredge that's the plan you check the cupboards hey research part i just used my current one damn where do you want to look next equipment on the table 
There's some strange looking prototype parts on the table. You can't see any use for them right now. I don't want to take them. On the other side of the table, you find a hastily scrawled note. It reads, not safe. Expect retaliation Im imminently. Evacuating to fort. There's a fort? Hmm. Okay. Um, look around the floor. Look around the floor. There's cracks in the base of the structure uh, grow to large gashes, and you follow them along the walls. Something extremely large and powerful created these holes. You slowly reach your arm into one like a fucking idiot. Oh, and I found a research part. <laughs> nice. You pluck an item from a gouge in the floor. Where do you want to look? Uh, wait. Oh, okay, at first I was like, why is it letting me still look around the floor? Uh, let's look at the generator. An old generator sputters and ticks over. Damn. <laughs> That's it. Alright, let's sleep. Let's find out what's going on here later. I still don't know where to actually look for my my objective. Oh, you know, I can actually I can just look at my map. Oh, it's dead center. Okay, dead center it is, let's go. Um Ooh, what was that? Okay, that's th those are tentacles. <laughs> Those aren't- that's not seaweed. That's- that's a big squid. <laughs> that's a big eel down there. Uh, can I fish that? That's kind of scary. That's kind of more scary though. Hold on, let me see if I- uh, Let me see if I can catch that big disturbed water stock low. Oh, I don't have the right equipment. That's a big fucking eel. Is that a grouper eel? That's got the big mouth. That's thick seaweed. Seaweed plus? That's- <laughs> That's not seaweed. I don't want to fuck with that. Wait, but that really is where the thing I'm looking for is. How the hell do I avoid this? Hello, giant squid. Maybe it is just seaweed. Uh, mm, um, it looks like a big mouth, but it's not like a squid or an octopus kind of mouth. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe it's just seaweed. <laughs> ooh, ooh, oh, 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 those are tentacles. Those are tentacles too. Oh, I don't want to be right there. That feels like I'm putting myself in harm's way. Why are these tentacles? They, I mean, these ones aren't animated though, so I'm probably fine. It's hard to tell if they're animated, really. Uh, it wouldn't bother with such a tiny boat. I can only hope. Because I don't want to get near that thing and just get one shot. I don't even know how much damage my boat can take from this thing. It is a beat boy. Oh, I got a nice ring. I can sell that. An ornate ring. Do I really... Is it... It's really in the center of all this, huh? Oh, uh, there's a thing I could fish, like, right there. Let's try this. Oh, that's like fishing, though. I need dredge. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> okay. Hold on. One of these... Uh, 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 uh. I swear that tentacle is going for me. <laughs> oh, I don't like it. I understand now why that old lady was calling me a fucking idiot all this time. Hey, fuck me! God damn it! Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh, a tentacle is a friend you haven't met. <laughs> I was wrong. Yeah, kind of. Oh, when was my last save? Okay, just right here. Holy fuck. I had, like, no time for that. Okay. Um, hmm. So, that's a fucking problem. This game is wild. This game fucking terrifies me. This is, like, the scariest shit to me. I hate... So, the funny thing is, is that there was another game on the, the random wheel that, um, it was called Still Wakes the Deep. Which is actually like ocean horror game. And I was like, oh man, I'd hate to play the ocean horror game. And it turns out that's this. I knew this game would be like a little scary, but it's also like it's a fishing game. <laughs> so it's like, it's not that scary.